Understanding the phrase, with the tide, a guide for English learners. Hello, everyone. In today's video, we're going to dive into the fascinating world of English idiomatic expressions. Specifically, we'll explore the meaning and usage of the phrase, with the tide. This expression is not just a literal reference to ocean tides, but it carries a deeper, metaphorical significance in everyday English. Whether you're a beginner or an advanced learner, understanding such phrases can significantly enhance your English fluency. So, let's get started. Before delving into the idiomatic expression, it's crucial to understand the word, tide. In its most basic sense, the tide refers to the rise and fall of sea levels caused by the gravitational forces exerted by the moon and the sun. The tide is a natural, predictable, yet powerful phenomenon. Now, let's explore the phrase, with the tide. When used metaphorically, it implies going along with the general direction or tendency of a situation or group of people. It's similar to going with the flow or following the crowd. This expression is often used to describe a situation where someone is not resisting the prevailing opinion or trend. To better understand, with the tide, let's see it in action in some sentences. 1. He decided to go with the tide and accept the changes happening in his company. 2. In the debate, rather than presenting a unique opinion, she went with the tide. These examples show how the phrase can be used in different contexts to imply conformity or adaptability. There are variations of this phrase that carry a similar meaning. For example, go with the flow, follow the crowd. Each of these has a slightly different nuance but revolves around the idea of moving along with the prevailing conditions or opinions. Thank you for watching our video on, With the Tide. We hope this has helped clarify this interesting English idiomatic expression. Remember, idioms like this add color and depth to your language skills, so don't be afraid to use them in your conversations. If you found this video helpful, please like and subscribe for more English learning content. See you in the next video.